Singularity of Action June 23, 2015 Greetings everyone. Before I begin this channeling, I would like to add a personal note. I know that I have not been in touch with you for what seems like eons to me. And many of you have been wondering where I disappeared to. The reason that I vanished so suddenly is due to a family emergency that has arrived at my shores without any warning. A close family member has had a stroke and everything changed in a split second for the entire family. The last three weeks I have spent day and night in an intensive care unit at a hospital assisting him in fighting through the density surrounding him, helping him find a link to himself, grab onto that link, and pull himself out of the karmic wheel of life. What an experience it was and still is, an experience of the most incredible growth of consciousness yet. Whilst it was the family emergency that has rapidly brought me to New York on a moment's notice, as I was spending every waking and not waking hour at the hospital, I realized that I was called there to assist many. I found myself working on many souls who were in the hospital at the time, seeing every single intricate occurrence that went on in every room of the hospital simultaneously. I saw new souls entering this planet and those who have finished their journey here on Earth departing. I saw angels and various guides working around the clock to assist all who are interconnected in this amazing web of life. Each second of every day was filled with tremendous energy flow which kept me awake for days. Surging energies pulsating through my body dispersing this life force not only throughout the hospital but many miles into the city. And whilst there, I kept thinking of the latest channeling that I have shared with all of you before my sudden departure. A channeling which spoke about grand changes coming our way, changes and wrapping up of loose ends as one phase is coming to an end and another is about to flung its doors wide open to all of us. It is there that I have realized that we are moving in the right direction for all of us. The right direction for Earth herself and for the universe at large. No matter the experiences that I have gone through in the last month, the lessons learned and the expansion of consciousness experienced not only by myself but everyone around me touched me to the core. Things certainly are changing rapidly now, and can go any way that we desire them to go, unexpectedly, urgently, swiftly. I know all of us are feeling the changes, and are being pushed one way or another to accept the inevitable expansion of degree of consciousness. And so, it is from the bottom of my heart that I send all of you the strength, vitality, perseverance, light, patience, understanding, and tremendous illumination of pure cosmic power of love to carry you through these amazing, and yet turbulent times. Once again we're getting there, and the support from the angelic realms and all our benevolent co-creators is felt, acknowledged, and welcomed. I also wanted to inform all of you that I am once again available for healing sessions. To learn more about what I do, please see my blog at www.sacredascensionmerkaba.com. Now having said this, here is the channeling that I have received from the Hathers. Singularity of action stems from the results of benevolent benign encounters of the unconditional understanding of being. Singularity of action stems from misconduct and misunderstanding of the reality structure of the matrix at hand. For through the matrix at hand, much has indeed been gleaned of the universal codices. For the codices of the universe which have unfolded to create a maze which you are experiencing, have made amazing strides into the direction of full awakening, of full accord of being, have allowed the universal consciousness to expand the mass of the degree of benevolence. The universal consciousness has indeed been influenced by that which is happening presently on your planet. Why is it then so important for your consciousness to expand? What is then such importance of said experiment? The importance of said experiment is to compare the zero degree of consciousness to the tenth of the billions percent of antiquity, to examine the core structure of society, to examine the cognition of said realities, and to finally arrive at the final understanding of said equation. The new reconstructive cognition and the debris of yesteryear are transforming into a new reality structure, a structure from which a new species and new beings and order of things shall emerge, leaving behind the matrix of the beholders and arriving at the new cognitive understanding of that which is. What we are trying to say to you dearly beloveds, 
is that the phase two of full awakening is rapidly spreading its influence throughout your world perfectly so, in alignment with all that you are. And so and thus, the informational decree which has been bestowed upon you is taking root and shape in the form of oneness, collective cognition of realities of the past, interlinking with cognitive understanding of that which truly is. The reconstructive abilities of human beings, their understanding of karmic realities, their understanding of changes occurring within, their knowledge of self, their desire to transform. The benevolent cognition of the principle of being, has ignited the core of your earthly structures. The core of the earthly structures have indeed been ignited by the considerable amount of transformation that has indeed taken place on your planet. The transformation within the core structures of earthly ways of life, through the chaos that you see unfolding rapidly before you, the human consciousness of those who indeed are causing said unrest, is showcasing to all that the release and purification of said objectives is well underway. The release of said energies, which the beholders are indeed experiencing and releasing, is transmuted into the light by those stationed on Gaia who have indeed been prepared for said initiatives who have indeed taken shape and form on your planet in order to attend to said goals and bring them to fruition. What we are trying to say to you dearly beloveds, is that as the unrest and deliberate exposure of the chaos that is being created, is nothing more than an act of kindness by that which you deem to be dark, for indeed the release of said energies within the human psyche is akin to a volcano erupting on the mount. For through the eruption of said energies the lava can flow freely, transforming the landscape and forming a new platform on which to grow, experience, and be. And so, and thus, as foliations erupt tidily within your emotional cognition of being, the earth and human beings are both clearing the way for a new platform to emerge. A new platform which already is underway and should emerge within your realities in the months to come. The new platform of cognition action, activity. For each and every moment of your experience, the souls who are set to release all that is standing in their ways shall release and unleash said energies. And so, the energy for the coming months shall find you riding a phenomenal wave of powerful vibrations, phenomenal wave of powerful vibrations uplifting you and carrying you faster and faster and higher and higher to the culmination point of ignition. And once said culmination point occurs, once all is in alignment with that which indeed is to be, once all are in place, a phenomenal spectacle of light shall be seen before your very eyes, a light vibration that has not been seen on your planet for hundreds of thousands of years, for eons. For indeed your planet and all who dwell therein are traversing time and space on their way back to whence they have come from. For all are traveling home, home to themselves, home to the new reality of being. And so, the experiment is coming to an end, and your roles of way showers, leaders, gateway keepers, key holders, guides, benevolent co-creators, and originators of all that is, is commencing, swiftly lifting you and carrying you to the locations around your globe where you are meant to be for the moment at hand. Throwing you rapidly into the swirling energies which you are meant to uphold. Assisting you in all that you are here to be. Stay in the light dearly beloveds. Stay in balance, in perfect alignment with that which indeed you are. In perfect alignment with the source of all that is. Remember your power and keep the ignition key ready, for the moment of absolute action is nearing. Remember your divinity and walk with dignity in your stride. Know that we are walking with you hand in hand and foot in foot. Know that you are supported by all that is. Know that it is so. For it is. That is all that we have for you now. We love you. We are with you. Goodbye for now. Channeled by Anna Merkaba. Sacred Ascension Merkaba.wordpress.com